Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to make a tandem axle rocking kind of suspension system for trucks in Scrap Mechanic. So, uh, here's a version of it, and you can see the truck is carrying a bunch of crates, and it's also made of concrete. So, what this is supposed to do is, it's supposed to allow the truck to keep the wheels in contact with the ground, and also um, carry more weight. So, what this does is that there's a middle suspension, um, as you can see, uh, wait, let me put this on a lift real quick, uh, yeah, so there's a middle suspension which is really hard, set to really hard, as you can see, connected to pipe which is connected to a bearing which this entire thing is connected on, this thing. Um, the, two pl the plate which holds the two wheels. And then, all these bearings are free-floating, so then on the sides you have more bearings which are connected to pipes which are connected to more suspension, like this, and these are set to much more soft. So, what this is supposed to allow it to do is allow the um, this entire thing to rotate like this, so this wheel goes up, this wheel goes down, and when you're going over hills, then this will... Um, move accordingly to the hill and not the car itself so uh yeah so let's test it uh i mean it does what it's supposed to do uh oh there's a rock right there uh so yeah it just drives it's rocking as you can see Oh, okay. Well, uh, yeah. So, to build this suspension system, what you need to do is you need, um, of course, your platform like that. Then you need your pipes like this um for this one you go three up uh right here like this go this way go this way uh put your pi other pipe here your suspension your other pipe uh wrong way your bearing um do the same on the other side Suspension, pipe, bearing, uh, then you do this, put your platform for the wheels, like that, uh, then your, uh, let me get my wheels real quick, like this. Uh, is this platform big enough? No, it's not. Uh, so you just extend it out. Like this. Put your bearings for the wheels, your wheels. Same thing on this side. Your bearings. Your wheels. Then, what you want to do is, you want to put the bearing down here. Like so. And then, you want to uh, put your two pipes this time, not three. Because the bearings are lower down. Then you put your stuff like this. Or stuff like this. And then uh, your suspension. And then... You do it till both of them are green, and you put it down. Um, then you do the same for all four. Pipe, suspension, pipe, green. 
pipe suspension pipe and your pipe your suspension and your pipe so now you have a basic rocker suspension uh don't forget to set your suspension to correct level so uh this one will be one two three four five six seven set to level seven for now uh this one one two three four five six seven these you just set to that And yeah, so now we could probably just throw a really basic front on this. Uh, let me just extend it out for just, um, like that. Your basic front. No suspension even. Just do that. Do that. your bearings on the sides your wheels uh then uh get your seats your seat i just place it randomly i guess for now like this and then you get your engine well, the truck over there only had rear wheel drive, so might as well do it here, too. Uh, to go forward. These two go forward, too. Connect it here. Connect this here. Ooh, wrong one. Like that. And then, uh... Yeah, you should be good to go. So, you can just remove the lift. Oh, wow, well, the back is higher than the front. That should be... Oh, wait, we have to set this up to, like, level 6. There we go. Uh, I want to speed it up a bit. A lot of trees here uh should have probably put front suspensions so it can actually steer well but uh yeah that's your back truck suspension now if these are too uh not strong enough uh you can just bump them up like so There. And, yeah, you can just drive off. Yeah, we probably should put front suspension on this, but should be fine. It's for a showcase. Uh, yeah, so, uh, thanks for watching, and bye. Keep doing donuts around this.